from uh, Detroit, Michigan, born and raised. I'm just a guy who really wanted to be a banker um, from the age of seven. And, and now I'm actually living my dream of not only being a banker, but having the opportunity to give back uh, to my community. So I moved here back in 2014. Um, and it's been one of the best decisions of my life. I love this city. Um, it's such a great place to raise a family. I would tell you the number one place that I've gotten support is from my spirituality. Uh, you know, God has helped me through so many different things. When I think about my success and, and the fact that I'm where I'm at today, uh, there's no other answer uh, but God being able to, to, to guide me. Again, I've always wanted to be a banker and that was for one reason and it was to actually give back to my community. And as I started to get in banking, I noticed that it wasn't a lot of folks who looked like me. So my number one goal was to bring as many folks who looked like me and had the same experience into the banking industry so that we can attack some of the structural and systemic racism that has uh, um, actually populated, quite frankly, our, our financial um, institutions for many, many years. My view of success is that if there's enough people who can look and say that Kalai Gibson actually helped them in their lives, helped them to accomplish their goals, or, or helped them just get out of a bad place in their lives, um, that's, that's the definition of success for me. And a lot of times, opportunity doesn't show up when you want it to show up, so you have to make sure that you're patient and prepared when it happens. And sometimes that opportunity is gonna look like something that you don't wanna do and may put you in an uncomfortable place, but the number one advice is to get comfortable being uncomfortable and those opportunities will fall right into your life.